Since it's a Wednesday and I have absolutely no lectures, I thought it would be a good day to do a day in the life sort of video, even though it's not representative at all of what I do on a daily basis. But I woke up about 9.40, so I missed breakfast like a true hero. Yeah, good job, Andrew. So yeah, then I had a shower and sort of got dressed, but YouTube has like regulations against me showing those sorts of things. So you'll just have to enjoy me brushing my teeth, because I know how much you love that. Oh yeah, look at that brush in action. Mmm. So yeah, while I, after I brushed my teeth, I sort of looked down and saw Tu Diras, the set Spanish textbook for my course. I picked it up and looked at it again because the blurb is just fantastic, like absolutely beyond measure. It says, Take a look at Tu Diras and you'll say, I love how the media components work with the book to help me learn Spanish. Well, that's weird, it's just what I said at the time and just what I've been saying for a few days now. I mean, the whole week I've been sort of joking about like, Oh, you'd have to be possessed to say that, but the thing is, I've, I've, I've been saying it. I've just been saying the blurb out loud, like, abruptly, for no reason. I mean, it's properly weird. I mean, I've been studying the book for a while now, so I've sort of stopped doing it as often, but I don't know, if you didn't have an immunity to it, I don't know what could happen. I don't know what could happen. Then it was down the incredibly imposing stairs of doom, as I like to call them. I mean, if you're going to trip and fall somewhere on the planet, it's got to be here. And there's an incredibly imposing door slam, which I edited out so that Nicky wouldn't wet himself. Then it was outside. I mean, if you're going to say one thing about the Aberdeen campus, you've got to mention about how lovely it looks. Just look at those arches. Look at those trees. Look at those green spaces. Yeah, you love it. And then it was down onto the high street. I mean, I know that I'm going to take this place for granted pretty quickly, and I hope I don't. But, yeah, I just hope I don't, basically. I mean... There's so many places that I could be where it could be drab and urban and just really modernised and stuff and I don't want that. I'm really happy where I am and yeah, I was just loving those cobblestones in the Taylor building. Then I happened across a lacrosse match while I was wandering around campus. I'd never seen one before but apparently it just involves loads of girls sort of running around in shorts, throwing balls and shouting. Which made me feel pretty dangerous filming it to be honest and I expected someone to leap out of the bushes and attack me at any given moment. I did do some other stuff that afternoon, I mean I went to the bakery to get my lunch, I went to the second hand student bookshop in the student association to try and get some French books cheaper, and I would have filmed those but I sort of treat my camera like I treat my penis, I only get it out of sporting events and in the privacy of my own room. Then I updated my Facebook status and here's that process for you. Ha ha ha, another zinger. After updating my Facebook status I had a look about my room for two dias because I couldn't see it anywhere. I mean, for one thing, there's the fact that it costs 42.99, and I needed it for every single lecture and tutorial that I have in Spanish. I mean, quite apart from that, there was the horrific mind-altering capabilities that it demonstrated earlier. And frankly, I didn't think that my floor had the strong will and Spanish knowledge I did to stave away the infection. In the absence of Tudiras, I thought I would read from Yucatan before and after the conquest by Friar Diego de Landa, one of the required readings for my Spanish course. Gav, I brought this up because I'm doing a one week sort of departure from film recommendations to bring you this book recommendation. When I say one week, I realise I didn't do one last week. Or the week before. Shut up. In any event, the point still stands, Gav, that you'd be really interested by this guy. I mean, I don't know if you've heard of him, but he's responsible for about 90% of the knowledge we have about Mayan culture. However, he's also responsible for destroying about 100 times the knowledge we have because he thought the, the minds were of the devil. After doing some classical Spanish, I wanted to get my phone charger back from Tishana, who steals it regularly, so I went down the corridor for a little wander. Hey, do you have my phone charger? Um, yeah, let me just find it. Is that my Spanish book? Uh... Yeah, looks like it. Okay, um, how did it get here? What? I don't know. I just turned around and it was... I love how the media components work with the book to help me learn Spanish. What the fuck? What the fuck? I think I'm gonna lie down for a while. What? Um, do you not think it's better if I, like, take the book? Um, well, not really. I thought I needed it for lectures and stuff. Well, I was thinking I sort of need it for background reading. You don't take Spanish. But maybe I'd like to. 
Fucking fine, man. Just take it. Jesus. All right, all right. See you later. Bye. I got back in slightly relieved to have two dinars back when I noticed something as I was kneeling down after putting it down on the bed. What the fuck? Suddenly everything fell into place. The book, the people, the quote, the weirdness. No, it was probably nothing. After the clearly insignificant incident with the book, I thought I wanted to have tea, so I went to go and see if Martin was up for it. Hey man, do you want to go for dinner or something? No, uh, I'm not sure. I don't feel like great, actually. Oh really? What's up with you, man? Ah, uh, it's strange. It feels like a bug or something, but... I just love how the uh, media components work with a book to help me learn Spanish. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, what? What did you say? I don't know. What, what did I say? What were we talking about, actually? Um, ne never mind, man. I'll just speak to you later. Did, did you see my Spanish book, by the way? What Spanish book? Uh, listen, listen, it doesn't matter. I'll, I'll just, I'll just speak to you later, man. See you later. Well, shit just got real. The book had possessed Martin without him even seeing it, let alone Tishana after seeing it and reading it for multiple minutes. This was a dire situation. I don't know how it could get worse. Or actually, is it even related to the book? Ah, who can say? Who can say? I'm sure it's fine. Okay, I've decided to make a run for it. If there's footage after this, it went well. If not, I will see you in the next life. Crombie Johnson has been overrun by these creatures. It's only a matter of time before they catch up with me. I'm hiding outside, but they're gonna find me and I just want to say sorry to everyone, it's my fault. I shouldn't have brought this 2D RS into the building, I should have. It was... I'm so sorry. They're coming.